There is a gland called the hypothalamus that exists in the brain and produces the hormone GnRH. This hormone causes the pituitary gland to secrete two hormones that control the growth and ovulation of the ovarian follicles. The levels of FSH increase during the menstrual cycle and cause the follicle to grow. The follicle continues to grow in size and produces increasing quantities of estradiol. Levels of progesterone remain low. In the uterus, the lining covering the inside of the uterine cavity, the endometrium, grows thicker. This is due to the action of estradiol. In the middle of the cycle, the LH surge results in ovulation. As a result of the rise in progesterone following ovulation, the endometrium transforms itself in preparation for the reception of the embryo. At the level of the ovary, the follicle transforms into the corpus luteum, producing progesterone, which maintains the quality of the endometrium, facilitating implantation. If there is no implantation, the corpus luteum degenerates, with reduced production of progesterone, and the endometrium starts to shed the uterine cavity lining, resulting in bleeding, that is, menstruation.